EVS 1, Chapter 19, Constituents of Food Vitamins and Minerals In addition to the macronutrients, we need certain food constituents in very small quantities. These micronutrients are vitamins and minerals. Vitamins The different vitamins are named using the letters of the alphabet. For example, vitamins A, B, C, D, E and K are the most important vitamins. Although we need vitamins in very small quantities, a lack or deficiency of any vitamin results in serious disorders. For example, a deficiency of vitamin A over a long period results in night blindness. Vitamins give us the ability to resist diseases. Minerals Iron, calcium, sodium, potassium are examples of minerals that are essential for the body. They are needed in very small quantities but they have an important part to play in all the necessary functions of our body. For example, iron is necessary for carrying oxygen to different parts of the body. If there is a deficiency of iron in the blood, the body does not get enough supply of oxygen and one feels constantly weak and tired. This condition is called anemia. The mineral calcium makes our bones strong. All kinds of fruits, vegetables, green leafy vegetables, sprouted pulses, their skins and the bran of cereals and pulses are all sources of vitamins and minerals. That is why, as far as possible, we should eat fruits with their skins and we should not sift flour to throw away the bran. A Balanced Diet Being fit and fine means that we have enough strength and energy to study, play, and carry out all our tasks quite easily. Our body is growing well and we do not fall ill every now and then. We all wish to be in good health. For good health, our body should get all the different constituents of food, namely carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins and minerals in the right quantities. A diet which provides all these constituents in the right quantities is called a balanced diet. Malnutrition If a person's diet lacks some constituents over a long period of time, that person does not get proper nourishment. Such a condition is called malnutrition. For example, if a person does not get enough carbohydrates and proteins, their growth is stunted. They feel constantly tired. They cannot cope with their studies or games or other tasks. Deficiencies of vitamins or minerals cause some specific disorders.